Hey, hey, hey. So, um, one of my lovely subscribers wanted to see the polka dot ones, the black polka dot on. And I told her I would come and show them because I haven't been on their site today, but the last I looked yesterday, they was offering 40% off. So, um, which is still a good price on these because they're regular $48. So, if you like pajamas, you need some pajama pants, you want to buy some new ones, now is the time to go onto their site and buy because $48 is a lot for um, pajama pants, in my opinion. <laughs> um, the only way I would buy these is if they are on sale. And so... Yeah, now is the time to buy. So I just wanted to show um, the polka dot ones, how they look on. And um, again, these are extra large. Um, I decided to go up because I don't, I don't like my pajama pants tight um, on me and, you know, too snug. But... The extra large fit perfect, <laughs> so I'm glad I didn't. I'm glad I did go up and I didn't order a large in these. So let me um bring this up. I just wanted to bring these up a little bit, you know, to show you up close what they look like. They do have the drawstring on here, very well made pajamas in my opinion um so yeah i just wanted to come and show these right quick because she wanted to see them on so enjoy give me that thumbs up hello hello i am back with another follow-up on these products that i bought i don't think i ever showed y'all this one but um, don't forget to give me that thumbs up. Subscribe if you not. Click that notification bell. Thank you to the ones that are subscribed to me. And that um, gives me a thumbs up. And have been, um, you know, uh, taking information from my videos and applying it to their life as well. So a follow up on these two. I do like these. Um, I will continue to buy them. Um, they clean really well have no problem with them um and it's a nice alternative to a toothpaste so this is um what's in it the ingredients that's in it so yeah they're just tablets white tablets clean teeth very well that's the most important it cleans your teeth very well and it doesn't even when you eat like you don't feel like a film coming across your teeth the first thing you eat you can get that with a lot of tablets and some toothpastes so that's what i look for to make sure they clean my teeth very well when because you have some that do not even when you brush and then when you eat you feel all like you run your tongue across your teeth and feel all that grit and film. Uh -uh. I've tried a few like that before. This right here was the oil pulling. Did nothing for me, really. Um, this English peppermint, I tasted no peppermint in this. Um, so, I don't know. But also, too, um, with oil pulling, I told y'all years ago I tried it and I stopped because... I broke out really bad and a lot of people say it's the toxins and this time it was bad again when um, I broke out. I had this huge red bump on my side. Um, it hurt so bad and it wasn't like a pimple. So I knew it came from me um, oil pulling. I'm not sure if I'm just allergic to it or... Um, like people said, it's the toxins coming out, but I couldn't deal with those toxins because um, it was it was bad. I broke out all around the same time, three different areas and these huge red bumps. 
I mean, huge. And they hurt so bad until they started going down. And I had even stopped the oil pulling from every day until like maybe once or twice a week. So that's a no-go for me. And then this was something that I picked up on my last shop, shopping, um, um, house shopping, monthly shopping, grocery shopping that you want to call in. It interests me. So it's a, um, what interests me was interested. Child. What interests me was the brushing. It was a brush and rinse. So I said, what is a brush and rinse? And I looked up the, um, reviews on it. People liked it. You know, so I said I buy a small one. They have them in bigger sizes, but I didn't wasn't sure what to expect from it or if I liked it. But I bought a smaller one. Can't remember what I paid for it. But um basically what you can do is, and I think they have a toothpaste too. I'm not a hundred percent sure because I just looked at this, but there's steps to it. So the first step is that you would pre-rinse your mouth, which I do every morning. I would swish it around my mouth to loosen up any food that was stuck in my mouth from the night before after I brushed. You know, sometimes I go back in and I snack and I do not go back and brush my teeth again. Um, so it loosen up any debris. Um, and then I do that for a minute and then spit it out. And then I go in with my hello tabs, crunch it up and then I would pour some over my toothbrush and begin to brush my teeth. It does give you a nice, uh, clean mouth. You know, um, you can use this, I guess, as a mouthwash as well. But, you know, I like my other mouthwash that I get. So I just use this as part of my brushing protocol. Um, and I do like it. So I will buy the, the bigger one. It just, you know, helps give you a fresh mouth. And it also... Um, adds to your brushing, cleaning your teeth. Um, it says it helps to whiten and freshen your breath. But before I go into brushing, I do scrape my tongue. I have a tongue scraper. That's very important. Brushing your tongue can help, but it's not going to get all of the bacteria and stuff that settles on your tongue during the night off. You need to go in and get a tongue scraper. And then when you're brushing, you can brush your tongue. So I do scrape my tongue before I brush my teeth. Then I go in and brush my teeth. Um, and so I, I like this, you know, like I said, a little um, enhance, you know, it says shake the bottle, use as a brushing rinse, swish with a um, mouthful for 60 seconds and then gargle with it and spit it out. It says to brush, but I spit it out and then I go in with a fresh couple of drops when I'm brushing my teeth. Um, it says to use as a pre-rinse and for best results, swish with a mouthful for 60 seconds and follow with steps two and three. And so that's what I do. I just don't use it as a mouthwash after brushing my teeth. Um, and it has pretty clean ingredients in it. As you can see right here. And it does have a minty, a mild minty um, taste. So as you can see, it has some pretty good ingredients that helps with um, mouth care and stuff like that. If you want to add to your, um, your oral care. And so it's called... Uh, essential oxygen br rinse um i look to see if they have a toothpaste maybe i'll try it you know um, i love trying different toothpaste to see what's out there and what's a healthier alternative that do clean the teeth so um that is my follow-up on these products and my review of this product it is something that i would buy again you don't have to but um yeah, that's that. So, um, on to the next and, um, give me that thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Tell me what you think. Would you buy these products or you can leave them? Also with oil pulling too, I want to mention, 
Um, you don't need fancy products like this. This go get you some coconut oil and um, the kind that you can cook with and ingest, not the kind that's just for your body. <laughs> um, please don't make that mistake because they do have some that you just use. It's just for topical purposes. And then they do have coconut oil that you cook with and that you can ingest. Make sure it's the kind that you can ingest and it's um, unrefined coconut oil. And you can just use that to um, oil pull because that's what I was using um, when I first started oil pulling years ago. You don't have to go in and get fancy stuff like this. Just get you a big old jar of coconut oil that you can cook with and ingest and you good and do do your oil pulling. You can add um, black charcoal to it if you want to, you know, and all of that stuff and you get a better bang for your buck. So that's all I got for you. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.